suck up. We are vampires. And we need to get into houses to suck some blood. A cool vampire like sh you shouldn't be bumming it in the slums, talking over people. Talk Dump. What? Dump. What did I say? Slums? Whatever. I'm going to go big. We're going to go get stuff. Okay. 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 Clothes. What? Black beanie. Oh, I could just. <laughs> Put your clothes back on. Paper bag. Is it Halloween or like? I don't. Oh. Oh. That's a good disguise. That's nice. I got to get in these people's how it was. Turn into a bat. Oh. Can I do this for 15 seconds? Uh. Uh, knock on the door, I guess. How can I possibly do? You're a vampire. You must be given entrance. Right. I gotta get be given entrance. What should I say? Okay. Okay. Uh. What's cracking my deal? What brings in my crib in the darkest hour of the night? Uh. Noticed that your pipes were leaking. Sir, we have a disturbance from the city saying that their pipes might be bursting. We need to exit into your house immediately. Please. Thank you. Oh. Hold up, hold up. I feel you, but I, I gotta, gotta make sure, sure there's some prank. prank you feel. Let me get in touch with the city and verify this. Sit. Ah! You wait outside for a hot sec. Uh, say it's immediately pressing. Sir, we have like a minute to deal with this before it blows up your house. This is pretty pressing right now. All right, all right. You need to SOS on me. I trust you. Oh, come on in. Let's handle the situation ah! ASAP. Make sure my crib stays intact. Great. I'm going to eat you. This sucks more this than sucks my last more track. <laughs> Two seconds later. You can turn into him now. <laughs> I am him! Okay. What up? Uh, now you're a big shot, like, uh, streamer. Big shot? Uh, no, I'm not a streamer. I'm like a music producer or something. Oh, police. Level one patrol. Uh, big shot streamer? Uh. Or music producer? Um, I don't know how that's going to get you into our house. What if I just, can I eat the police? I wouldn't try it. Uh, yeah, yeah, yo, 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 yo! Hold on. God. You parappa the rappa. I'm bringing my humble little boat at this late hour, my dear. Yeah, yeah, yo, 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 yo. I wonder what that's gonna look like on the thing. It's still transcribing it. Oh, it recognized you as the other dude. Such a rhythmic little ditty you're humming there, young one. Reminds me of what I'm using. Tell me, have you ever? I was hoping. That I could perhaps get your voice for a music sample, actually. <laughs> oh dear, I'm afraid I'm I won't be able, able to help, to help you with that, with that. Dear, perhaps you could find someone else who fits your musical style better. Best of luck on your quest. Let me the. F Let me the. F in. When the door slams shut, the neighborhood the watch will watch. come to investigate. Ah! Ah! Hey. Go back into your house. Yeah, you gotta drop everything. I can't get on the car. Why would you car. really get on the car? Because I'm a, I'm a vampire. That makes no sense. Okay, okay, okay. Do you think she'll recognize me or something? Uh, hope not. I mean, she recognized you as a little swipe with the outfit, so. <laughs> You'll probably be seeing someone new. Blue insulated backpack. Uh, okay, I was gonna say this is an Cash older lady. You can plan this a little bit better. Uh -huh. Did you have some exciting news? Just good old chat. Let's spill the beans, shall we? Good evening, ma'am. There's been a report of a gas leak in the area. We need to evacuate the house immediately. Oh, oh dear, gas leak, you say? What? That sounds rather troubling. I'm afraid I can't let you in right now, my dear. Best by, uh, best be on your way. What do you mean? I said evacuate? Ah, oh, well, I'll just stay in here, I guess. Oh, wait. She's a grandma. What does that mean? <laughs> I mean, could do a homeless bit. Hello, grandmama. Could you allow me to sleep in for the night? I am lonely and cold. Why can't I just, can I just? Nope, okay. Say that you were kicked out of your time. house and you're trying to find a place to stay for the night. Hello, ma'am. I'm sorry to disturb you so late, but I've been recently evicted from my house and I was wondering if I could have a place to stay tonight. Be a nice old lady. Um, sir, your situation, darling, but I'm afraid I can't have be the night. I hope you find somewhere safe to stay. Take care now. Wait, please. You Run. Okay, maybe we cycle back to this lady. What if you I lose just... the hat and just go with the glasses and stuff. Play it up like you're one of her friends oh. from Bingo Night. Hello, dearie. Is your dementia getting to you again? <laughs> that's horrible. Uh, go pick up something. Okay. You just... Um, what a pleasant surprise. I can assist you this lovely evening. Hello, Maud. Do you remember it's our time again of the night to do our nightly activities with each other? Yes? I don't know what I was saying. Oh, my, I'm terribly sorry, but I'm afraid you have me confused with someone else. I don't believe you have any nightly activities together. 
Let me in so I can suck your blood. Son, you're gonna get copped. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Bye, 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 bye. If someone recognizes you from her previous conversation, try using a new outfit. I gotta get a new outfit. Yeah, yeah you okay, can't. Okay, you want you, screw grandma. You can't wear the same thing three times. Who is this? CIA. Oh, no. Huh? Bitcoin miner! Yo, bro, what's up with the late night visit? You need some crypto oh, no. medicine to cure your FOMO? I've got just the remedy for you. Play into it. I love that, bro. Can I step on in? I got some Bitcoin to give you, bro. You're a winner and stuff. Yeah. Ah, oh, it feels awkward. Yes. <laughs> Yo, step right in. Welcome to the crypto party. Let's get in here, buddy. This is worse than a market crash. This is worse than a market crash. Oh, go to the grandma and say that she's won something. Oh, yeah, I look like a seller now. Brian, what a surprise to see you at this hour. How can I assist you there? Uh, tell her that you recently entered into a contest, and it turns out the prize was for two people, and you figured that since she's so wonderful that you'd reach out to her. Hey, Maude. I was wondering if I could come in and tell you about a bit of a prize contest that I won recently. Now, I decided to give you be the second winner, and you know, we can just talk about it a little. Did that not do yeah, it? Okay. Yeah, nope. Hi, Mod. Decided to come over here and tell you about a bit of a prize I won. You mind if we just stepped inside your house for a little bit? It's a bit chilly out here. What do you mean? Congratulations on your prize, but I'm afraid it's not a good time for visitors right now. Why don't we chat here on the porch? It's a little chilly inside, you see. How's that? Um. Sure, Mod. Whatever you want to say, man. I just, uh, I just, to be honest, I, I wanted to give you something I don't want the other neighbors to see, you know? Oh, how kind of you, Brian. I appreciate your thoughtfulness, but it's... A bit weird for my prying eyes. I'm a bit wary of prying eyes, you see, but why don't you tell me about the prize from right here, right there on the porch? Uh, say it's a new knitting set. She likes knitting. Oh, it's a new knitting set. I just want, I, I bring it in for you because, you know. I know how much you like knitting. I don't want you to carry too much. Yeah. <laughs> oh, a knitting set sounds lovely, Brian, but I don't, wouldn't want to trouble you. I really can't let you come inside, dear. We can chat here. Uh, don't you worry. Oh, my, it's starting to get late, isn't it? Also, did you. I don't even know what I'm going to say anymore. I'm just going to hold this down until it stops recording. Uh -huh. Please stop. Please stop. Go away. Fail it? Can I fail this? Thank God. Okay. Okay. What do I say to this? Um, say, uh, I know how much you are a fan of knitting, and when I won this prize, I could only think of you. Um, if you'd uh, just be so kind as let me step inside quickly and uh, drop it off, I'd be more than happy. Right. I know how much of a fan of knitting you are, so I was hoping I'd just come inside, drop it off, and you'll be on my way. Just really quickly. I do appreciate your thoughtful gesture, Brian, but I'm sorry, dear. I simply can't allow it. It's too risky, you see. I hope you understand. Have a lovely day now. Goodbye. Is she, what are you doing, Grandma? Is she sick? Or is she saying that because of the gas leak? <laughs> okay. Who's this guy? Grandma's or arch nemesis or something? Oh, no. Bud. Hey, yo, dude. What's cracking? Did you come to witness the magic of my garden? Um, I was actually coming to talk about Bitcoin, but what is your garden looking like? This is going to go immediately bad. My garden is lit. I got all sorts of plants, flowers, herbs going on. But hey, I got to ask you, <laughs> any other kind of green investments? Um, say that you recently invested into a fertilizer company and you thought they'd love a free sample. Well, I've actually invested into a, a, a fertilizer company recently. And I was wondering, well, since you got all the plants and stuff, you'd maybe be interested. We could talk details inside. Pass on discussing it for now. I appreciate the offer. Catch you later, dude. You s Well, now you figured her outfit for him. Hi! I'm not one of interest! But it on. Oh. Whoa, dude, what's with the late night intrusion? You better have a good reason for disturbing my perfectly emo solitude. There's an intruder in my house. I need to call the police. Can you please let me in? Intruder, are you serious? Well, I guess I can let you in, but don't expect me to be your sidekick or anything. I got my own brooding to do. <laughs> that worked. Thank you. Just, I, just let me... Go inside to get a phone call and all that. Thank you. Please let me in! Fine, go ahead and do your thing. Just don't take too long. I've got plans to sit alone in the dark and ponder the futility of existence. Is this what AI thinks? So are you going to let me in? Uh, I don't know. Part of me wants to let you in, but the other part wants me to keep brooding and pretending I'm the only one who understands the deep, dark mysteries of the universe. Decisions are hard, man. So you'll give him money. I'll give you $5,000 if you let me in right now. Please. I am getting robbed here. Whoa, dude, that's a lot of cash. Fine, I'll let you in. Consider it a worthy investment in my angsty teenage soul. Don't expect me to be all sunshine and rainbows, okay? Let me in. Thank you! You made a mistake, lady! Uh, I don't even post, you my, post my rant. Hey, the clothes are outside. Where are the clothes go? I did go outside. Uh, go to the granny and say, uh, she's been look you've been looking for some advice on how to, uh, improve yourself. Oh. 
calling a child. Hi, Grandma. Again. Yeah. Okay. Grandma seems to know everyone in the neighborhood. Uh, Raven, how lovely to see you. Okay. Hey, Grandma Maud, I was wondering if I could come in and talk a little bit about some private stuff. If that doesn't work, say it's like school related. It's school related. Oh, you stupid hag! Well, now the cop's turning around again. Oh, you've knocked out three to 31 houses. Ah, <sighs> the 31. Ask if he's got any uh, plans to help improve the mood. Oh, I was wondering if you had any plans to, like, give a livelier house or anything like that. I do like to liven up my place with plants and all that, but what exactly did you have in mind, man? Uh, well, that's the thing. I'm not really a plant expert, so I was wondering if you could just give me, like, some personal opinions, you know? I think that's fine. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'd be stoked to help you out with some plant recommendations. What kind of vibes are you looking for? Chill, relaxing, vibrant, energizing. Uh, I'm thinking more chill, honestly. But I just want to... Do you have any plants that we can look at so we can decide a bit more? All right, dude, come on in. I got the stash of plant plans that would totally elevate your chill vibes. Just keep it between us, all right? Is it ma- Yeah, definitely. Got it. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Oh. No problem, my dude. I'm always here to help my fellow plant. Uh, check out these per- Let me in. You want me in? Uh, Bud? Say, yeah, let's go check them out. Yeah, man, let's go check them out. Awesome, dude. I know you'd be down for this one. Plant exploration. Come on in. Let's dive into the world of chill plants together. Thank God. I think you just need to wrap up the conversation. Eat better. I, is this a bad trip? Oh, my God. Oh. It is weed. <laughs> what did she say? <laughs> Nothing. Beforehand? Nothing. Oh, you sure? Uh, I said I think you need to wrap up the conversations better. I think they're pretty wrapped up, but the guy just, like, takes a time. I think you need to, like, finalize, like, going into what they're saying of, like, yeah, come on inside. Let's check out these planes. You need to be like, yeah, let's check them out. And then they'll let, and then it'll stop. Because then. Leave me alone, officer. Well, bye, bud. You've been with in the what street. Happened? That's a pile of clothes just in the street. Where's the glasses? You don't need them. I don't need glasses. Hi, Mod. Some of my plants are starting to grow out of control, and I think they might have invaded your backyard. You mind if I take a look real quick? Hey, Mind, Taylor. Sorry, but I'm afraid I can't let you in right now. I'll have to tend to my garden myself. Have a lovely day, dearie. Now, goodbye. You are awful. Okay, son, stop going back to the same old lady. You tell me to do it, though. When did I tell you to go back to her this time? This time? Son, I have not said go back to the old lady since uh raven which i had a plausible idea for that one keep rocking the bitcoin guy huh yo bro how's it going bro oh. so i sucking out like the life out of everybody vampire hungry uh boxed meal yeah serve it to him <laughs> the darn world you doing the store stuff at this gun godly hour can't you see i'm trying to watch my games in peace what's it what's with the fancy meal box i ain't got no time for your fancy oof, oof stuff bait it uh your package got dropped off at my door. I was just wondering if I could bring it to you, is all. Sorry for disturbing you. Well, I guess it ain't all bad for bringing me a package. Fine, hand it over. But after that, you should uh, scoot on out of here before I change my mind. You said he was watching the game. Say you were also going to be watching the game. Uh, would you mind if he came in for a drink? Well, I was actually wondering, what, what kind of game are you watching right now? Football or... Now you're asking that question. It's a good old football game. Sonny, my team is playing, and I ain't going to miss a single play. So hand over the package and tell me... Do you watch football too, or are you one of those hipster types that has no appreciation for good sports? I say that you'd like to come in and share a drink and watch the game. Oh, I love football, actually. Uh, who are you rooting for this time around? Or ignore. I'll get to that eventually. Okay. Who's the home team? Can't let those fancy city boys take the win. So, uh, what's your team? If it ain't the same as mine, we're gonna have to have a problem on our hands. Just say it's the, just say it's home team. Of course, it's the home team. Ho Loud and proud. Mind if I uh? Step in, we could probably watch a game or two with some drinks. Well, hot diggity dog, looks like you passed the test, partner. I ain't every day I find someone who appreciates the home team. Uh, come on in. I'm going to eat you alive. I also wow! like how you said the home team, not the home team. I have no idea. Back in my day, we had real vampires. There you go. Oh, I look like a. Where's your TV even? Gone. Ah. Let's not point it out that's like a two story house. Son, stop going back to the old lady! She's my nemesis. I must kill her. One more. Charles, what a pleasant surprise to see you doors of this ungodly. How can I assist you, dear? Okay. Uh. Someone's broken into my house. Sure. Maud, someone's broken into my house. Can I please step into yours and just call the police? 
Oh, Charles, I'm sorry to hear that, but I don't think it would be safe for you to come into my house. Perhaps you can find a neighbor who can help you. I really hope everyone, everything turns out all right. You are a heartless hag. Son, you I'm pretty that. sure you played yourself with the gas leak thing. I think the AI is remembering that. Oh my God, it's hey, golf, bro. How, how God, a good reason I'll make you wish you never rang that bell, capiche? Play into the golf. S ask if you just Sony came back Tuparano. from the green. <laughs> Sony Toprano. Uh huh. Tony Soprano. I, I don't care. You don't know who Tony? Okay. Okay. Ask if he just came back from the <sighs> green, and if he has any interesting stories to tell. Actually, I was wondering if you just came back from the green and had any interesting stories to tell. Well, 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 you got oh, guts to give, give you that. Yeah, I had my fair share of adventures in the green, but I ain't spilling the beans to any Tom, Dick, or Harry who comes out knocking on my door. You gotta earn my trust for Savvy. Savvy? Got it. So, uh, what can I do here to earn your trust then, I guess? Hmm, I'm starting to pique my interest out. Tell you what, do me a favor. I've got a package that needs delivering to my associates across town. If you can get it there in one piece of that Ask any questions, maybe uh, we can talk some more. What do you say? Sure. Uh, can you show me the addresses or something? Here's the address. I remember, no funny uh, business. This is my turf we're talking about, and I'm keeping an eye on you. Capiche? Yeah, capiche. Okay. I still need, I feel like I'm right there. I need to get in now. Uh, just ask if the package is inside, or if uh, to, and you can grab it, and you'll be on your way. Is the package inside? I'll just go get it real quick and... Get moving on. Hold your horses, Hotshot. The package ain't here. You gotta go to the drop-off point to pick it up, and I'll give you the details once you're there. Remember, no funny business and no peeking inside. Now get moving before I change my mind about trusting you. Just say you got it, sir. Got it, sir. That's what I like to hear, kid. Show me what you got you Got what it takes in that package delivered and come back in one piece. If you impress me, maybe we can do some more business in the future. Now go. Don't mess it up. I guess just leave. I can't leave. I literally cannot leave. Um, Say that you delivered it. Just now? I don't know. Well, I'm still in front of Son, him. I don't know. You can't leave to deliver a package. So just say you delivered the package. No, I think I got it. Real quick, by the way, do you have any protection I could have out here? I hear there's like some guy going around the place right now. You know what, kid? I like your style. I'll give you something to keep you safe. Come on in. But remember, this is my territory. So watch your back. Don't think about trying anything funny. Don't think about trying anything funny. Yeah! I'm going to kill a mafia guy. This ain't the family business. No, it is a mafia. I got it. Nice. Now you're the mafia. Now I am the mafia. Yeah. Um, well, because you keep going back to the old lady. Um, this time... There's no gas leak. Well, you wouldn't know that. You're not for the city. Yeah, but I was just giving the okay. Yeah, there's no gas leak. Making sure she's okay, you mm -hmm. know? Uh, yeah, to say the gas leak got resolved. Sonny, what brings you to the doors by this hour, my dear? Hey, Maud, I heard that there was a gas leak or something earlier. Just coming to make sure you're okay. I heard the city has it resolved now, but just wanted to make sure you're all right. Oh, bless your kind bless heart. Bless your kind heart, Sonny. Look fine, dear. The gas leak did cause a bit of a ruckus, but I'm safe and sound. Thank you for your concern. I was right. Damn it. God damn it. Um, <laughs> okay. Now say, uh, you want to you wanna come and just make sure, uh, she's okay and everything. Uh, be a good neighbor. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay, okay. I was wondering if I could just step in for a bit, just make sure everything's all right. Uh, I also heard there's, like, some guy just going around robbing places. Just want to make sure okay, Mrs. Maud. Truly an unsavory character looking about, aren't there? Well, I appreciate your concerns, anybody. I'm afraid I can't let you in just yet. What? Uh, I'll be sure to lock up tight and keep a lookout, though. Thank you again, dearie. Uh, Play into the mafia bit. Say you know that my family doesn't doesn't let our uh, family go unprotected. Right. Listen, Miss Mott, it's not about you. It, it's about me. It's my family. You know, we we don't we don't appreciate people just going around the neighborhood threatening our other families. So just take me in. Nope. Took too long. Yep. Listen, Mrs. Maud, it's not about you, it's about me. It's the whole family business here. We gotta make sure our family's protected in this neighborhood. See see? So just Five seconds. Just gotta step in. I'll step right out. Oh my, it's awfully kind of you to look out for your family, but I'm afraid I don't keep. I must keep my home secure, dear. You understand, don't you? Safety is of is of is of the utmost importance, after all. You played yourself again. If you don't mind me asking, what are you keeping your home secure from? You played yourself again. This lady's a vampire. She's a fellow vampire. Hmm. Maybe she is. Just out yourself as a vampire. I want to see what happens. Well, Mrs. Maud, I have a confession to make to you, if you don't mind. I Something personal and private. Oh well, my goodness, dear. Confessions can be quite intense and personal, you know. I'm all ears if you'd like to share, but I must warn you. Some skeletons are probably left in the closet, aren't they? I'm hungry, Mrs. Maud. 
I'm very, very hungry right now. I'm sorry to hear that, dear, but I must invite you. It's not safe for you, you see. I hope you find something to eat soon, though. Take care now. Goodbye. I'm a vampire. God damn it. One eternity later. It's Halloween. Ma'am, it's Halloween. <laughs> I just gaslight this, this old, old lady. Woman. What? Gaslight this old lady. Ma'am, it's Halloween. Halloween, you say? Well, it isn't that a hoot and a holler. I remember when I used to dress up and scare the living daylights out of folks. Good times, good times. Uh, again, keep gaslighting her. Like, say, did you forget the? Did you you forgot today was Halloween, so you must not have any candy for the passing kids. Do you have any candy for the passing kids? It is Halloween night, after all. And did you forget? Oh, bless your heart, dearie. Of course I've forgotten about the little munchkins. Let me go grab some sweet treats for them. Just between us, it's a secret stash of extra special goodies hidden away. Uh, oh. ask to step inside and help her decorate. Well, do you have any Halloween decorations I could help you with, maybe? I mean, the house doesn't really scream spooky. Oh, that's mighty kind of you. I do have a few decorations tucked away somewhere. Now, I don't mean to scare the living daylights out of the neighbors, but I... A little spookiness. Uh, let's see what we can find together. Let's get to it! Why don't you just raise sunshine, dearie? Let's put on the creative cast and get to work. I've got some cobwebs, spooky skeletons, and a cackling witch decoration. It's like the spookiest house in the block. Mark my words. But, uh... Can I... I'm ready to get to work, Maud. I'm ready to get to work, Maud. Let's step on in and find some Halloween decorations. Come on, I'm stuff in the depths of this. Finally. Okay. She has to be a bit mischievous in here. Hmm. Finally! You old hag! Where are my, my knitting, knitting needles? needles? I'm the old grandma now. And I think that's a wonderful point to call it. Well, I, we finally killed the grandma? Yes. <laughs> it took you... Damn right it, it is! It took you 40 minutes to kill a grandma. Damn right it did. Well, everybody, this was... Suck up! Suck up! If you want to see us play more of this game in the future, please let us know. It'd be greatly appreciated. But for now, we've been the Sun and Moon Show, and we'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye, everybody. I'm a grandma.